Hi guys, welcome to another video. This is my first time to fly in Italy. We're just going to fly to Rome. Uh, I'm with my family in airport Katowice in Poland. And it's just going to be fun, I'm sure. As I understand, this is the biggest airport in Italy. Check this out, guys. This, like regular people living in Rome. This is regular buildings around here. Some landscape. And this is our hotel where we stay in for, for actually for three days. It's called Occidental Aeron Park. Under this video, you you, you can find uh, some useful information, some links to this hotel, maybe some places we visit. It's a pretty quiet place, so greeny. So many trees around here. Huge balconies. All right, guys, check it out. This is our room. The bed queen size or king size? This is king size or? King size. Okay, so. One extra bed for kids. <laughs> we've, got, we've got some buff gel. And without soap, soap actually. And here's a huge balcony with a gorgeous view. So quiet space around here. What are you doing here? Papa, <laughs> Bathroom. And I don't know why, but it's, there is no soap. Such a good place. The price for this room around 100 euro. But we've got some extra taxes from Rome. Uh, it's around 6 euro for person per one day. So uh, I've already paid some extra taxes. 36 euro for two person without my kid. So take into account that fact. And I guess this is wrong. You can find information about this hotel under this video in comment section. Check it out. Ok, 
pros and cons of this whole room. Let's start with cons. Isn't working. I hope you don't like the privacy. The shower. Empty. Let's talk about the pros of this hotel. Uh, this hotel is not pretty far from the city center, it's around um, 40 minutes by bus or by, by taking the subway. And around this hotel, so many parks, and around this hotel, so many places to try some local foods or some Asian foods. Uh, we've twice been in Asian restaurants. Uh, under this video, I want to share with you uh, links to this restaurant, Asia, this Asian food. And uh, around here, we've got some store called Yebra Spin. It's pretty convenient to to buy some some local things in this store. So, guys, taking into, into account that uh, in Rome, you it's difficult, so difficult to find some affordable apartment with a good price. And price for this hotel is around 100 euro, and it's pretty affordable for Rome. Actually, I could recommend this uh, hotel. This Bianco. This is so. If you want to try some kind of this meal, this called Risa Gon Gamberi and for euros price. If you're gonna live on countryside as me or even stay in the same hotel, I, I would recommend you to visit um, some Asian place near my hotel, near this hotel where I'm staying. Just take a look, guys. That's how these local people are living. So many balconies with some flowers, so beautiful here. Okay, guys, one of my dreams were to see Coliseum on, in the Rome. And dreams comes true. Just check it out. This is Venice Square. This is like some monument and a small little thing behind the monument. We run and go still every time. Whatever it is, and keep on trying. Can you see this rainbow behind?
guys and uh, under this video in comment section I left uh, some place called two sizes where we, where we can buy such of things I don't like uh, usual this desserts but this one actually pretty good and so tasty and delicious you should try this definitely this place called Roman Forum check it out Alright guys, I want to share with you some secret place, some secret square uh, Near the Vani uh, Square you can find the following place Check this out Hey bro, where are you from? From Odessa? From Odessa, Ukraine? <laughs> Look at this, no people here it's about maybe 10, 10 people here. Good. Guys, my first impression of this city is this is so huge and so old. You definitely should come here. And this is what should you know about Italian coffee. I'm not doing it. This is one portion of coffee. Not so <laughs> okay, here are the result of first day exploring the city. Ouch. Ouch. All right, sandals and socks. Sucks. Okay, it's much better. Let's go ahead explore the city. Piazza Navone Not so many people here I don't know how it's working. It was created 2,000 years ago. And no one knows how it's working. We took away 
So this is San Angelo Coastal. Guys, check it out, this view. Behind me is Vatican and some beautiful river. So I'm on my way to the Vatican City. This is almost the same view from the pub eyes. Wearing the mask is still required here, so I should wear this one. The, there is a lot of seats, and as I understand, uh, the pop is coming from here, from that balcony is up there, and this is where a lot of people are crying usually. Alright guys, extremely important information, where you can find the toilet. Exactly, when you cross crossing the border to Vatican City, you can find the toilet behind me. And your life will be saving. If I understand correctly, this is the biggest cathedral in the world and you should definitely come here and to see it, all this beautiful place. This was done by Michelangelo.
se vogliono accumularsi sono i benvenuti dopo l'incontro del Santo Padre l'incontro con Pietro qui adesso This is so important place for believers and so beautiful place. You definitely should come here. Guys, don't forget to bring some water here. I think it, it should be really healthy. So guys, I'm not a huge believer, but I'm so impacted by this place and you definitely, definitely should come here and take a look to this place to feel this power you know it's like mm, huge mental power huge human power all the stuff you can find here and you should uh, you should feel it How it's possible to drive here? Yeah, I don't know actually. Guys, why you should visit this church? Because of 3D illusion of illustration inside of this church. Guys, check it out. The garbage on the bike, all the street. I have never seen something like that before. Garbage on the bike, on the street. Amazing city. All right, guys, check this volcanic sand behind me. Where am I? I'm a Mediterranean Sea. This is free beach for visit. And not so pretty far from the hotel where we're standing. It's around 50 minutes away from the hotel. If you want to rent some car, you will be there. You will be here maybe in 30 minutes, I guess. So Rome is not only walking through the city, it's, it's uh, a beautiful beach called Gambrinus. Uh, I will have some useful links for this beach. You can find it in the comment section below under this video. And guys, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Uh, and please leave your comments below under this video. Give me a thumbs up if you like it. This is my first experience to recording some video in an English language and i hope i will do it pretty pretty often in the future and enjoy guys some kind of volcanic sand take a look it's so black and so hot okay it could be noisy here it's a Mediterranean Sea and the temperature of water is around 17 degrees now and definitely I should try this.
we are looking to something to eat. Italian traditional sales. After the lunch with margarita pizza, you should definitely some chill out here. And it's look like something like that. People are out just chilling. Chilling with my bro. Actually, it's my son. Four years old. So. Guys, what you should know, it's so blessed to be under the peaceful sky. Just take advantage of peaceful chill out near the near the beautiful sea with your family with your relatives and that's all you need from this life definitely all right guys this is Spanish square okay it's pretty cute Check this place out, guys. There are three big lakes around here. So we arrived to Poland and let's make some bottom line about this travel experience. And a long story short, you know, I, I was trying to keep my mind open to some new thoughts, some new ideas from other people and Every trip, every country teach me some new, some new opinions about life, about some life-changing decisions. And I want to share with you guys uh, what teach me Italian people. This is my point of view and uh, this is uh, how I feel, okay? So Italian people for me, it's like so open people. I've never been an Italian before, so that's my first expression about this country, about these people. What, uh, what I like in Italian people, that if you want to do something, you just, just do it, okay? If you want to drink some beer or some, some wine, just do it. If you want to smoke it, just smoke. Don't rush to leave. Spend more time with your family. Enjoy your life. That's uh, the main message I want to share with you guys today. And thank you for watching this video. I am waiting for you in the next one. And bye, guys.